Hello friends. This video is brought to you by MyWayTeaching.com. Let us read the question. In the given figure, AD is equal to CD. So AD is equal to CD and AB is equal to CB. AB is equal to CB. State the three pairs of equal parts in triangle ABD and CBD. We have AB equal to CB. It is given AD equal to CD. Again it is given and we know that BD is equal to BD as it is the common side. Hence we can say that the two triangles that means triangle ABD is congruent to triangle C B D by S S S property. Hence we have answered the second part of our question also in which we had to find out whether the two triangles are congruent why or why not. Now let us come to the third part third part says does BD bisects angle ABC so angle ABC is this angle and we have to find out whether BD bisects this angle now clearly triangle ABD and CBD are congruent means they can overlap each other and that is only possible if the two angles are equal that means angle ABD and CBD are equal only then the two triangles can overlap that means that BD bisects angle a, B, C. Now let us move to another measure of congruency of triangle. Suppose I give you one triangle and ask you to draw a copy of it or in other words to draw a congruent triangle to it. You already know that giving one side is useless as many triangles can be drawn on the same base. Now suppose I give you another information. Say I give you that one of the angles of my given triangle is 65 degrees. Then can we draw a congruent triangle to it? No, we cannot because we can draw many triangles who can have one of the sides to be 5.5 centimeters and one of whose angles is 65 degrees but still they are not congruent to our given triangle. That means some more information is required in this triangle so that we can draw a congruent triangle to it. So let us modify our statement. In this triangle the length of two sides say the sun is 3.4 centimeters is given and 
the angle between these two sides is given then let us see if we can draw a unique triangle which is a copy of it let me draw a line segment bc 5.5 cm in length now let me draw a 65 degree angle at b so using a d we have drawn a 65 degree angle at the vertex b now it is given that the side that is included with the angle is 3.5 cm so let us use the ruler and mark 3.4 cm arc on the line and name the point of intersection as a now if we join ac we get a triangle abc which can completely overlap my triangle and which is congruent to the given triangle hence if side angle side is given to us then we can draw a triangle which is congruent to it hence we state that if under a correspondence two sides and the angle included between them of a triangle are equal to the corresponding sides and the angle included between them of another triangle then the triangles are congruent by sas property